Hi Daisy Tribe, oh my god I feel so good saying that Daisy Tribe, Daisy Farm, Daisy Nation Welcome back to my channel In today's video I'm going to be telling you about my top 10 items when it comes to child care, child raising, child rearing It was quite difficult you know choosing the top 10 because I have a lot Watch out for my other videos where I will give you my top 10 items but in other aspects okay So yeah I'm starting from number 10 and my number 10 top 10 item is metal tail combs okay metal tail combs this is what they look like i have so many of these combs you guys in so many colors anytime i'm shopping for items from aliexpress or from amazon i always make sure to add this metal tail comb simply because of this metal tail okay for this part i don't really care about it you can always get any good small to tail comb but the most important part for me is this metal tail simply because it is gentler on the hair it doesn't snag the hair it doesn't you know bring out particles or whatever that can you know cause split ends or drag the child's hair i love it i'm always going to have it i have so many of these because it gets missing easily in this house especially and sometimes this metal part comes out right and this part will get missing so i always buy it i always have it and i'm always going to have it thank me later i'm going to put the link to all the products i list in this video in the description box so that you can purchase them from amazon okay now the next item also relates to the previous item but this one ranks a little bit higher simply because there are so many of this type of thing in the market but this particular one is the best that i have found for baby's hairs okay and for your kids hairs your children's hair and it is this rubber okay this colorful rubbers yeah i have these hair rubber bands in different um, sizes okay different colors different sizes i have the really small ones which i use you know most times i i bought like a pack of 2000 or something i always buy though but i bought like a pack of 2000 these small rubbers um the thing about these rubbers is that to an extent they don't really hold the hair so well they don't really hold the hair so well so if you use them for a hairstyle they might not last on the hair but the reason why i always buy them and i'm always going to be buying them is because they do not cut your child's hair okay they don't cut even as an adult if you use them they don't cut your hair simply because they are very fragile and are very smooth okay they are very very smooth and very fragile so they don't drag your hair instead of your hair strands to cut the rubber is going to cut okay funny enough i'm dragging this one very much out okay okay it has ripped okay <laughs> i thought say it doesn't rip that easily but yeah it doesn't actually rip that as easily as you know i might be sounding but it rips more easily than the regular rubber bands but the regular rubber bands actually hold on to your hair and they're very difficult to loosen you yeah i i always i'm always going to go for this ones okay i always make sure i am using products that do not snag or you know at their hair strands do not cause their hair strands and do not cause pain or strain on their you know follicles okay because some of these products that we use some of these hair bands that are very very strong they actually you know make you make the hair very tight okay with this one it's very rare for you to make the hair very tight no matter how many times you you know turn it it will cut so you won't be able to make the hair so tight okay yeah so that's why i absolutely love it okay um honorable mention i also have these ones these are the seamless rubber bands there are no seams on it um but these are more like um cloth ties um yeah they don't really have seams on it uh, on them so they don't really drag your child's hair so i use this one sometimes to you know add more color to the hair but you know my all-time favorites are the tiny you know rubber bands now the next one coming as number eight is this hair you know shield this cap for washing hair um yeah i'm not talking about hair products you know now trust me other other products are not really hair products but the reason why i had to add hair products in this is because i get so many questions about my kids hair how do you wash their hair how do they especially when they are babies how do you wash their hair without them crying without soap getting into their eyes or the shampoo getting into their eyes um how do you protect their faces from water how do you grow their hair how do you i guess how do you grow their hair probably a hundred times a day okay that's an exaggeration but yeah i get that question a lot and this is one of the things that helped me a lot in washing my kids hair is a must have i've had this one for years i have different Different types you know but this particular one works so well i can just put this on my child's hair and i'll wash their hair and not even a drop of water will touch their faces okay and they're not lying down they're actually sitting down upright and water will not touch their faces um for right now ava 
Cora has kind of outgrown it Eva a little bit but for Sophia this is very very important Sophia is my two year old and yeah it's very very important okay so I have been using this since she was born if you watch my video about how to grow your child's hair I'm going to leave a link in the description box if you haven't watched it but if you watch that video you will see that you know she had this on her hair absolute fave I love it now the next one and I promise you this is the last hair product I'm going to mention okay it is this detangler okay now the exact detangler i really i have used for the longest time i don't have it right now it is the the Cantu kids hair detangler you guys it is my all-time favorite if you watch that video you know about how to grow your kids hair i am very sure i mentioned this in that video okay all-time favorites this one comes second this is the shea moisture coconut and hibiscus kids extra moisturizing detangling detangler okay but the Cantu care one oh my god that product is phenomenal, it's amazing. I know many people don't really like Cantu products, especially for black hair. Many people don't like Cantu products, but for me, that particular product is a must have right from when my kids are babies. I remember buying one and giving it to my sister when she was traveling with her daughter to Canada and she absolutely loved it. She had to call me and thank me again because it helped her, okay? I, I, I love it. I don't know how much I can talk about it, okay? Um, yeah, I'm sure I put a picture in the, on the screen of what it looks like. You guys, I use it right from when they are born to detangle their hair every time I have to comb their hair, okay? It makes the hair very soft, very easy to comb, very shiny, very beautiful. I love it, okay? Now, coming in at number six is the Baby Beyond High Chair. Let me just show you guys what it looks like. After Eva used it, I gave it to my friend, she used it for her child and then I collected it back, you know, and I used it for Sophia, okay? And Sophia just recently outgrew it, even though sometimes she tries to force herself into it, but you guys, this high chair, this high chair is a must-have. I'm going to leave a link to, to it as well. It wasn't so cheap, but it's the best thing ever i love it it's very sleek you know no extra material no extra thing to wash that holds on to dirt um yeah it's very sleek very easy to fold and put in your car you can also remove this part you can also remove this tray this is the so this is the tray you can also remove this tray to wash you don't have to carry the whole thing to wash if your child spills on it okay so most times i just take this out wash it very well i can even serve your child's food on it because i mean once it's clean they can eat of it and it grows with your child okay so from six months your child can use it and your child will feel snug and at 18 months two years your child can depending on your child's size anyway your child can also use it and it will be you know perfect for your child now at number five is mavala nail polish okay i'm sure you're wondering what is nail polish doing there what does it have to do with kids it is made for biters nail biters for suckers you know people that suck their fingers for them to for, for it helps them stop sucking okay now let me tell you one testimony about this mavala okay Cora was a sucker she sucked her fingers for the longest time since she was like maybe six months or something she started sucking her fingers and she sucked for a very long time i think when i eventually bought this mavala she was already over five years old okay and at that point i felt like she was never going to stop sucking i had tried putting plaster on her hand putting different things on her hand but she always eventually removed them or you know she'll be so frustrated at that that i would be forced to remove it okay when i was just tired of you know coping with it because when you have a child that's sucking sometimes they fall sick easily i don't know if it is the sucking that causes it but i feel like they fall sick easily they are always having infections because they are using that, that finger that they used to touch you know all kinds of things and they put those things they put that same finger in their mouth and they really really suck it okay and it's right for cora who was sucking her right hand she suck her two fingers or was it one finger i can't even remember but cora used to suck her right hand so imagine using your right hand to touch every touchable and then you put that right hand right into your mouth okay so she's sucking school everywhere and it was so disgusting to me after trying everything i decided to just do some research and i saw this mavala and i decided to go and buy it now disclaimer okay or warning mavala is meant for children that are three years and above okay it's not meant for children that are under three years so i bought this mavala i applied mavala on cora's fingers for i think one week like it took one week okay normally if you put it on the fingers it takes like a few days for it to go it's very very bitter i think that's basically what it is it's a very 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 extremely bitter nail polish one day i put some on my finger and <laughs> just just a little bit i touched my tongue it was this disgusting it's very very bitter so there's, there's no way a child can really suck through it okay they'll just be angry so anyway i put it on cora's finger and i think i put it just twice and in the space of a week 
was it up to a week? Maybe like six days or something. Yeah, maybe like six. It wasn't up to a week. But just know that in a space of a week, Cora stopped sucking. This is someone that I felt like she could, she could never stop. She stopped sucking her finger. She never went back to sucking her finger. Even till date, she hasn't gone back to sucking her finger, okay? Yeah, Mavala is a must-have. Again, the link is in the description box. If you have a child that is sucking, please try it. Now, they said that it doesn't work for all kids. Some kids actually <laughs> are very, very stubborn. But I'll be shocked if it doesn't work for your child because Cora was a serious sucker. It's not those ones that suck once in a while, okay? Cora used to suck all the time and she stopped it in the space of six days, okay? So, it's worth noting. Now, the next item is this nail cutter. It is from Safety First. I think Safety First is the name of the brand. I'm not sure. But yeah, this nail cutter, you guys, this nail cutter is a must-have. First of all, it was made for kids, okay? If you look at it, it's very, very safe. The cutting part is very, very small. It's actually made for your baby's fingers, okay? No matter how small, even, even if it's a newborn baby, a one-day-old, a six-month-old, a two-year-old, a five-year-old, sometimes I even try to use to cut my nails, okay? It is very safe. You would hardly nip, you know, at the baby's skin. Aside the fact that it was made for babies, it actually has light, okay? Can you guys see it? It has light, so you are going to see the nails very well. And you guys know how scary it is to cut your baby's nails, especially when they are still small. And you know, at that time, their nails grow and they start using to scratch their faces and all of that. But it's quite scary to cut your baby's fingernails because they're very tiny and so delicate. This light plus this nail cutter part, okay? The light plus this, the blade part makes it easier. But even on top of all of that, even with all those advantages already, it has a magnifying glass. Like, sold 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 you guys the magnifying glass you know helps you plus the light helps you to see exactly what you are cutting okay i can't emphasize enough how important this product is for your baby so please go and get it okay now coming at number three and this one might be a little bit controversial okay a little bit okay coming at number three is my children's tabs okay my children's Amazon Fire it tabs, okay? <laughs> you guys, I can't do without my children's tabs, okay? I don't know how other parents do it. All the no screen time parents, all the no tab parents. I don't know how you guys do it, but I, it couldn't be me, okay? I can't do it. I can't. They have this and they also have their television. Obviously, I regulate how they use it, okay? It doesn't mean that because they have these things, they are on it 247. Most times during the week, they don't have their tabs with them. And even on weekends, I don't allow them use it all day, every day. Um, I, I have some measures in place to either shut the tab off or for us to always keep their tabs. I always tell them, oh, you've used your tab enough. Let's go and charge it for you to use tomorrow and then after Sunday, that's it. No more tabs to the next Friday, okay? So, I actually put things in place so that they don't watch their tabs all the time, but they must watch their tab. You guys, they must have these tabs. This is the Amazon Fire 8 tab. I have bought and bought different tabs. I think I bought, um, aside from Amazon Fire 7 before I graduated to Fire 8, okay? Cases that come with these tabs are very, very good. If you know how many times my children have thrown these their tabs, see, this one is a... Um, advanced one this one is for six to twelve years um it was the special edition i guess what they call this thing whether graffiti or whatever whatever i can't remember and this one is a zero to six years i think um this one the screen is actually broken and that was because my kid somebody I, 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 let me not call who but somebody threw this tab she was a mistake anyway so let me not blame her she threw this tab for from upstairs and it landed on a stone like this okay that was why it broke but trust me before then sophia had thrown this tab several times from upstairs down and it did not break okay then a bigger child now said she mistakenly threw it down and it broke but i'm just saying all that to say that they are actually quite sturdy but you have to be careful with what is inside okay so whenever i get the tab i format it i remove some things i private some things i put parental control i do all sorts of things on the tab to make sure that you know they're not just accessing any kind of thing on the tab or they're not just watching nonsense okay now coming in at number two is this nasal spray you guys nasal spray nasal spray whatever you want to call it nasal spray is very 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 important for your children especially when they are newborn okay when they are newborn when they are still babies when they are toddlers 
you need nasal spray <laughs> it helps to loosen the mucus so that you can now you know suck it out or clean it out it helps to even help them breathe properly when they want to sleep i always make sure i spray it into the child's nose before the child sleeps whenever they're suffering from qatar before they sleep i spray it into their nostrils and you know just put them back to sleep and it helps them sleep very well and breathe very well because it helps just losing all that mucus so it's not blocking their nostrils and they're not uncomfortable okay yeah and that leads me to the number one greatest product of all time okay greatest child care invention of all time <laughs> And that is the nose Frida. Okay, you see this product? You see this actual product here? This product is a lifesaver. Okay, it is a lifesaver. Someone like me, I mean, I love my children, but I don't want to suck out snot from your nose with my mouth. Okay. I don't want to do it, okay? Some people like to do it, some people prefer to do it, some people don't know better, some people just feel like you know you have to do it. Me personally, I don't want to do it if I don't have to do it, okay? So yeah, I was so glad to get this nose feeder. I haven't used it in a while, okay? In fact, I don't even know what it's still doing here because I haven't used it in a while. Um, and my kids are now older, they don't need it as much. Maybe, I think I just, I still kept it because of my two-year-old, I don't know. She hasn't learned how to really blow kata well, so I, that's why I kept it. So yeah, this is the suction part. This part goes into the baby's nostril, not into the baby's nostril like too much, you just towards the entrance of the baby's nostril. That's why it's very, very small like this, just towards the entrance of the baby's nostril. Then you put this, it has a filter here. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it. It has a filter there to prevent, you know, the snot from going into your mouth or to prevent your saliva from going to the baby's nostril, okay? Um, yeah, so it has this and it has this tube. So you put this at the baby's mouth. I usually have someone hold the baby, actually my husband, you know, just have him hold the baby because they also get uncomfortable. Once this is coming close to their nose, they're like, eh, eh. So I just say, okay, please hold the baby for me. Then I put this at the entrance of the baby's nostril and I just suck it. Like suck it, suck it. <laughs> It's quite disgusting too. That's why I can't even imagine using my mouth and to, to do it, okay? It's quite disgusting. But you put this up the baby's nostril, then you suck it. Even on the pack, the illustration is there. And it clears their nostrils very well. In fact, I feel like it goes to the throat parts to clear their nostrils very well. So once it clears, you just take this tube, you know, take the tube out like this, you go and wash it. I usually just change the filter or, you know, leave the filter in and change it after a few times. Um, but yeah, that's it. This particular one came with extra filters. These are the filters. You can't really see it, but let me try and bring out one. Yeah. So these are the filters. Yeah. So you just put it in the bottom part of the um, this thing. You just put it here. Like now, if I remove this one, let me remove this and put a new filter. Just put it. Put it in. Um, yeah. It just helps to prevent bacteria from going either from the baby's nose to your mouth or from your mouth to your baby's nose or baby's nostril and yeah it's a lifesaver you guys you don't have to use your mouth to suck out kata from a baby's nose i know you love that child yeah just go and get this please okay it's not even safe it's not even hygienic for you to be using your mouth to be sucking out kata from baby's nose and if not done right you can enjoy the child you can i don't know it's just it's so icky to me that's why <laughs> this is my number one product okay it's disgusting to me yeah that's it guys those are my top 10 must have baby care products you know um let me know yours in the comment section if there are any of these ones that are also in your top 10 let me know if there are other ones that i didn't mention that are in your top 10 leave a comment down below and let me know which products you absolutely love and you're always going to buy yeah like i said the link to these products are going to be in the description box so that you can check them out and buy them okay please do not suck snot out of your baby's nostrils don't do it okay don't do it it's so disgusting <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys!